Yo, what's up, everybody? The new Pirates of the Caribbean set is out now, which includes Davy Jones. We got Bebe Girls, Elizabeth Swan. She look good. And last but not least, Captain Barbosa. In this video, we're going to see if they're worth buying or not. I'm going to share some gameplay, some combos, and my thoughts on the skin. So sit back, relax, get the snacks on deck, and enjoy. Okay, if we go to the shop, you will find a button right here for 3,400 V-Bucks. The total value of all items together is 5,200, but if you buy the bundle, it is 34, which is, I'm going to be honest, a pretty insane deal anyways let's check out the uh, separate skins first off we got elizabeth swan 1600 we do got the skin right here let me give you a quick 360 on the skin okay she looked pretty good i'm gonna be honest though compared to how she looks like in the movie does she look like her i ain't gonna lie it's a little i mean she looked good right here you know I mean? she looked good but does she actually look like the character from the movie I don't think so. I haven't seen it in a while. I'll put up some pictures, but maybe they didn't get the rights for her, or I don't know. I don't know. Just something seems like it's not her, but she still looks good. Next up, we got the Lego variant right here. We also do have the Dead Man's Chest, which is a very simple backlink, but I like it. Small form factor. It is reactive. Uh, let me see if I can find out what that is in the future. I'm assuming it's kill-based. Anyways, we also do have Elizabeth's Favor. Pretty simple uh, sword, but looks pretty nice next up we have captain barbosa captain barbosa i like the name yeah anyways captain barbosa his clothes everything the grittiness looks so good looks insane the face he he kind of looks like him a little bit uh is it like exact i wouldn't say it's exact but like it's pretty darn close some people could say oh maybe he needs more grime uh, maybe i want to see his messed up teeth but he looks pretty freaking good yeah he looks almost the same anyways we do have the lego variant as well uh this lego variant kind of whatever to me i will i just looks like a generic pirate am i tripping he looks younger here too for some reason next up we have barbosa's sword pretty nice like i said the swords you can't go wrong with them man and the juiciest one out of the whole set in my opinion we have Davy Jones Locker. Who's seen that one episode with a uh, SpongeBob? <laughs> the Davy Jones Locker episode with the ghost, the, the flying Dutchman. <laughs> that was so fun. Anyways, quick 360 on the skin itself. This skin looks insane. You got a bunch of details on the little tentacles. Obviously, he's not going to be hyper realistic. It does have like a more um, kind of Fortnite feel to it where it's like realistic, but it's still a little bit more for nightatized i don't know what that means but you get what i mean right it's like not super realistic but it's almost there if you look at the one from kingdom hearts 3 the game is a couple years old now he looks insane though he looks so realistic i think it's more realistic than here so you'll get an idea what i mean i wish we could have that type of realism in this game let me know if y'all would like that but obviously they want to give it that kind of fortnite feel like it still looks realistic but not too realistic anyways i love the claw you got some bullets um actually i don't think they're bullets they're uh it's that one little thing that like clings onto boats and uh whales i forgot sea urchins i think i don't know you guys let me know in the comments below anyways uh we got some uh, coral action going on i think right coral growing on his leg obviously this looks nasty if <laughs> if y'all got this on y'all rest in peace yeah anyways we got some coral action right here yeah i'm pretty sure there's coral and then, uh, but I, I like the feel. Like, some of these look like bullet holes, but they're not. I really like the hat. Everything about it looks pretty sick. I love the little, like, crab arm and the crab leg. Next up, we do have the Davy Jones um, Lego variant. Honestly, he looks pretty cool. Uh, I don't know about these tentacles, though. It looks like one big mesh. I wish it was kind of separated. Maybe uh, more unique. Maybe some texturing, some shadowing. But it looks kind of just like, I don't know. It's kind of weird. I like the peg leg, and uh, I wish the the leg and the arm were a bit bigger, especially the crab arm. That would look insane. Next up, we do have the little Kraken. Little Kraken action. Back bling. Okay, my man looking a little suspicious. I'm not going to lie. He brewing something nice. He probably making some Zaza. <laughs> he got that Nickelodeon uh, ooze in his jar. This reminds me of uh, Black Ops Zombies 3. I think it's called Shadows of Evil, that first map. You could actually pull these little guys from uh, the chest and uh, they would distract the zombies, which was pretty nice. Next up, we have the Norrington Sacrifice, another blade. You got some uh, sea urchin. I don't know if they're sea urchins, but you get what I mean, along with some seaweed action going on. 
Uh, pretty simple, but like I said, you can never go wrong with the swords. Anyways, you get all these with this update. I think Jack is going to come in the past on the 19th, I believe. So be on the lookout for that. And last but not least, we do have the Davies Pipe Organ. Let's check it out. Okay. Oh my gosh, my man. My man Mikey looking serious. He kind of killing it though, I ain't gonna lie. What was bro cooking? Can I have seconds, motherfucker? I, I don't know what I'm saying, but yo, this is really cool, no cap. I like the little stool he sits on, and then like there's just a floating like clam kind of piano. Pretty solid overall, I like the smoke coming out of it too. 500, it is a little much, but... I mean, a lot of detail going on, and I love the fact that it's included with the bundle. I would wish if they would add like a wallpaper for the bundle, but aside from that, 3400 is a solid price. Very solid. I would have expected they would have uh, maybe had two characters in a bundle and uh, Davy Jones as a separate one. But the fact that you get all three together is pretty fire, man. You're pretty much getting it skin for like um, a little over 1200 for each skin. Maybe 1100 actually. Something like that. Somewhere there in between. So, very solid price overall. You definitely do get a discount. And keep in mind, as of now, if you buy this skin right here, it will retroactively add the discount to the big bundle itself. So, that's very nice. Shout out to Epic for that. Not a lot of companies do that. At least not that I've seen. Usually, they'd, they'd want to make you. you want, like, you feel forced to buy the bundle first because you're like, oh, if I buy this, uh, dang, I'm, I'm, it's like I'm wasting money. So, yeah, if you buy one of these skins, you will get the retroactive uh, discount on this. Okay, so... Very nice feature. I hope they never change that. That being said, what is y'all favorite skin out of the set? Which one are y'all capping? If y'all can only buy one, y'all buying Barboza? Little Barboza action? Little Swan action? Or some Davy Jones locker? I ain't gonna lie, Swan. She look good. Definitely got me that one. I like all the skins, to be honest. Davy Jones definitely look good. Elizabeth Swan, she look good. Barboza, he look clean. He definitely looks accurate to the movies. Uh, for the most part, with a little bit of fortnite sized action going on. <laughs> I don't even know if that's a word, yeah, but y'all get what I mean. Also, I forgot to mention that she does have a style without the hat. She look good! Yeah, she looks so good with or without the hat. That Without the hat, though, she definitely looks, um... She kind of bad, though. I don't <laughs> What that mouth do? I don't mean, Alright, I'm tripping. Alright. Anyways, y'all messing with the content. Y'all want to see more videos like this and y'all want to support. Please consider using my code crow adlex I'm going broke. Catch you boy live on Twitch. On to the gameplay. Okay, we are in creative. Got the floating animation. Let's hit him with a dive. Boom! These Wraith wings look insane on the skin. Not gonna lie, definitely fits the vibe. By the way, the Contra looks insane on the skin as well. I don't know. I think it looks so good on every skin, to be honest. Anyways, the code to this map will be in the pinned comments below. So enjoy. By the way, if y'all do enjoy the map, make sure to like and favorite the map. Helps a lot. Anyways, quick round up from the top, side to side, quick sprint, quick slide, quick smanel, and a quick jump. Did I say smanel? <laughs> okay, that's kind of cool. You see the pickaxe? It's so weird saying pickaxe. It's a sword, but look at the sword. I like the way he takes it out. It's like a very unique way of taking out the pickaxe. What do you guys think? I've always said this. Like, I wish Epic would give us the opportunity to use every unique uh, pickaxe animation and customize it on whatever skin we want for example now that i own this skin i have access to the swing animation and uh, let's say i want to put it on another skin i think that'd be really cool you guys let me know what you think i know some of them might look jank but that would be pretty cool anyways uh you got the little octopus you know what i mean after zaza but uh looks pretty good let's swing around real quick okay yeah it's a i think this is a new animation that look that looks so cool yeah it pretty much uh imitates like he was fighting like he's having a sword fight. Dang, that's pretty cool. So imagine if you got both characters just fighting. I wonder if they have the same uh, animation or something slightly different. Anyways, close up view. My man looked like he just heard the worst news of his life. Uh, <laughs> he looked depressed. Anyways, skin looks very solid. I do like that they went with the more of a realistic kind of look. It does have more of a, a realism effect. Still slightly cartoony because of Fortnite, but... It is a very solid skin overall, side by side view. For some reason, I know he's a little bulky, but he kind of looks slim too, which I like. And uh, I really love these like effects on the skin. There's so much going on. I like the crab action. Almost looks like a bird from this side. Two eyes, 
the beak looking like a flamingo. I ain't gonna lie. My man got a flamingo on his arm. Oh my goodness. And it looks like he's just grubbing on some little, like, I don't know, like a worm or something. Like a cockroach. Cockroach. Little cockroach action. Little Australian cockroach action. That's insane. I'm not gonna lie. Anyways, quick ADS. Walking forward, walking back, crouching, walking forward, walking back. Okay. Let's hit some in the back right here. Quick rapid fire. And what time it is, let me hit y'all with some juicy and succulent 90s. Oh my gosh, yeah, that those wings look so cool. Anyways, speaking of pickaxes, let's check out the pickaxe impact effect. Uh, I'm a little disappointed with this. It's uh, just a basic yellow splash with some orange sparks, but... I'm gonna be honest, the swing animation makes up for it. More than makes up for it. I think it's so cool. Really looks cool on the skin. Anyways, quick rapid fire uh, slides. Okay. And let's see how it looks like at night. Okay, I don't think nothing's glowing. Let's go somewhere darker. Somewhere more chill. Yeah, nothing is glowing. You, you one could say that maybe the eyes, the highlight of the eyes of the octopus, that be smoking in the Zaza, uh, you could see it kind of shine. It's kind of cool to be honest. What do you guys think about that? That's pretty cool, but yeah, there's nothing really shining. Such this is such a cool skin, yeah. I, like I'm really messing with it. Yeah. It's such a great skin. Let's try this winger animation again. Oh my gosh, what do you guys think, man? Let me know what other glider comments you guys got. This looks so cool on this skin. Imagine seeing this at night, just flying at you with all the mythic guns, all the medallions. You're done, bro. You're, you're done, buddy. GGs. <laughs> By the way, real quick, this side looks like with no backlink. Same sequence. What do you guys like? With or without the back wing? I think he looks pretty solid with or without it. Very nice overall. I really like the jacket. I like how one of his arms is covering it and the other one's just hanging. Very cool detail because uh, obviously his little lobster hands are not going to be able to fit. So very nice detail. By the way, this waistline on the cloak looks so good on the skin. Oh my. Check it out, chat. That looks so good. Another one I like too is this fin right here. Very nice. Anyways, we got Elizabeth. The Contra looks so cool on the skin, yeah. I feel like any pirate skin is going to look good with this um, Contra on glider. Anyways, quick rundown from the top, side to side. Quick sprint. Quick sprint. Quick glide. Quick man one. A quick jump. I'm going to remix the word, y'all. <laughs> Let's check out the pickaxe. Okay. Uh, this is more of a regular kind of swing animation. I I'm going to be honest, though. Looking at Davy Jones, I wish that they gave uh, the other two a uh, unique animation. Maybe give us a choice, a style from this one and the other one. Because this one, uh, I mean, it still looks good. It looks good, no cap. But um, I'm really messing with the, the other one, to be honest. Anyways, close-up view on the skin. You know, like I said, baby girl pretty. She look good. You know what I mean? Like the hat, loving the hair, loving the eyes, loving the lips, all that. Uh, more realistic kind of vibes, features on the skin. You see a lot of dirt, a lot of pirate action going on. They definitely looking for the One Piece. You know what I mean? Also, you do notice that she does have nails. If you guys didn't know, Fortnite does kind of cartoonify some of their skins. Like, their um, brand is pretty much just, like, blocky kind of fingers. No fingernails. So, I do like the real the realism on the fingers as well. And I think she's rocking some pink uh, nail polish. That's what you call it? I don't know. <laughs> nail polish and paint? I don't know, yeah. But I like the boots as well. Okay. Why'd she shake her head, yeah? Did I say it wrong, baby girl? My bad. Let me know what it's called. Okay, anyways, side-by-side -side view. Yeah, very solid skin. Only thing I would ask is maybe they, they give us a style that removed the jacket, the coat. That would be nice. But the, the skin is very solid. I, I like it a lot. I like this little um, bandaid on her arm. I'm pretty sure in the movie she does injure herself on her arm. That's why she has this. I think, uh, I think Jack Sparrow is the one that put this on her. Or, I'm not too sure. Maybe it was the other guy. I'm trying to remember. It's been a long time, years since I've seen the movies. Anyways, quick ADS walking forward, walking back, crouching, walking forward, walking back. No cap. I might rewatch them um, after the review, chat. Maybe sometime this week. It's giving me uh, the itch. No cap. Quick rapid fire. Okay. Let's hit you with some juicy 90s. Okay, let's break it down. Same thing, let's check out the impact effect. And once again, orange spark, nothing crazy. Uh, I mean, I wish that we had something else, but not too bad. Let me know what you guys think. Anyways, let's see how she looks like at night. Okay, let's go somewhere darker. 
Uh, once again, I don't think any of these skins are going to glow at all. But I like to check regardless. Also, I said it before, Epic, can you please give us an option to like if I kill a bot and backwing is um, reactive, can it activate? Because when I eliminate them, it does not activate. And I ain't gonna lie, yeah, I'll be too lazy. I don't want to go to Team Rumble and then have to wait and then float down and then find somebody to eliminate. You know what I mean? I want to just be able to like eliminate a bot here and have the same effect. What do you guys think about that? I would love that feature. It would save so much time. Quick ADS, walking forward, walking back, crouching, walking forward, walking back. Quick rapid fire. Okay, let's end it off with some 90s once again. Okay, last but not least, we do have my main man, Barboza. Quick roundup from the top side to side. Quick sprint, quick slide, quick mantle, and a quick jump. By the way, I do love the sway on his coat. You see a lot of details on it, and I do like how it kind of moves around when he's running. He definitely has that realistic kind of vibe. I love the feather on top of his hat. They did a great job with the skin, chat. I'm not gonna lie, I'm very impressed. Obviously, if in a perfect world, I'd love them to even have a more realistic face, but you could see slightly, it's still slightly cartoony, but it definitely is more realistic. Like I said, it kind of got fortnite <laughs> I don't even know if I'm saying that word right, I'm just making it up. Anyways, top down view on the skin. Like I said, he does have fingernails, a little bit more realism. I love the patterns on his uh, on his vest right here. You got the glocky wacky ready to shoot. Pretty nice skin. Love the dirt on the boots. Side by side view. Yeah, very solid skin overall. I really like it. Like I said, the only thing I would change, maybe make it more realistic. But that's just feedback. It's not really a, a downside. He looks really good. He looks solid. Anyways, quick 80. Yes, walking forward, walking back, crouching, walking forward, walking back. Forgot to put on the back wing, so I'll put it on after this. But you guys let me know what y'all think, man. Anyways, quick rapid fire. Let's end it off with some 90s. Okay. Let's swing the pickaxe real quick. Okay, you notice with this one right here, he does have that swing animation that Davy Jones has as well. Let's check out the impact effect. Oh, this is kind of interesting. This is like a white kind of spark. And uh, for some reason, I like it way more than the others. It's a little slight difference. That's all we need. And it makes it unique. Yeah, I like how he has the same animation as Davy Jones. Very cool detail. I mean, maybe uh, Bebe Girls didn't have it because she's not as experienced. I'm pretty. Yeah, now that I remember, she was not a pirate. She uh, pretty much got slightly converted into one because of all the BS. So maybe that she does. Maybe that's why she doesn't have the skills. But I would love a style for that. You know what I mean? Quick slides. Let's see how he looks like at night. Once again, I don't think any of these skins have any. Uh, glowing parts as you can see right here I'm not seeing nothing by the way before I forget let me guys show you the emote as well you know what I like is that uh let's try it at night it has a glow effect to it that looks so cool chat imagine being in battle royale it's it's nighttime you just see a motherfucker just playing the piano it's a 1v1 the last two standing what are you doing I ain't gonna lie, I'm dropping my items, my medallions. You won, buddy. I, you know, I don't want the problems. Bro playing the piano, he gotta have Ultra Instinct. <laughs> Matter of fact, I just realized I don't think Barbosa has a back bling, so maybe that's why it's a bit cheaper, but still very solid bundle. That being said, oh, oh my man, you throwing it back? Oh, hell nah. My bad. Anyways, that's one thing I would have loved if they did give us a back bling for Barbosa. If I miss it, I come back, but. There's how he looks like playing the piano. He looks so insane, yeah. Let's see how it looks like in the dark as well. You guys like it when I take the emotes in dark? In dark mode? Looks very evil. I like it. Very nice. Anyways, to finish it off, let's see how she looks like playing the piano as well. And uh, let me know if you guys like me uh, doing the emote on every skin. I feel like it's kind of nice, right? Because not everybody's going to be able to get every skin, so... At least you guys know how the uh, the emote looks like. Looks pretty nice. Let's see how it looks like at night. Same thing. Yeah, I really do like the glow effect. It's like I was gonna say. I hope I wish the whole thing was glowed up, but as you can see, there's only a candle. So I actually do like the slight realism where like you see like that little orange glow on on the left side. Maybe uh, it would have been better if they gave us two candles. You know what I mean? One on the right. 
but uh, very solid. Definitely gives that ominous vibe, and the piano definitely looks realistic. That being said, what skin are you guys gonna buy? Which one is your favorite? Anyways, for the juicy combos, first we got Couch Titan, Robin's Perch, Borealis Backer, Good Girl Wings, Fire Starter, Deadpool's Katanas, uh, Basement Key. Basement Key looks so good. Anyways, if there's a combo that you didn't see in the short that you feel like would look good on the skin, let me know in the comments below. Let's start a discussion. Anything uh, brown, white accents, black is going to look good on the skin. So let me know what you guys got. Anyways, I got a bunch of combos here, so there's something that you might like. Not everything is going to be perfect, but there should be something juicy for you guys to chew on. Number one looks so good. We got Quack Pack, Quackity Pack, Rear Guard looks so good, Thunderbolt Aegis, Teachings of Miyagi, Tana, we got TA Hunted, Solid Skull, Shattered Wings, TMN Pizza for the Grub, Wix Katana looks godlike, Wolf Pack, Wu Tang representing last but not least, Zero. By the way, I'm curious, would you guys like a separate video where I actually drop like perfect combos, maybe like five or ten for each skin? So like it'll be less, but it'll be way more quality, like maybe uh the pickaxe, the back bling, the glider. I don't know. Just something I'm thinking about doing. I don't know if I'll do it or not, but you guys let me know in the comments below. Now for Davy Jones combos. First up we got Robin's Perch, Borealis Backer, Sidju of the Alliance looks so good, Weapons of Witcher, Godlike, Good Girl, Firestarter, Avatar Psycho, looks pretty nice, Perfect Wings, Wasteland's Cloak looks so godlike, same with Sapling Groot, loving the vibe, Mudamasa Blade, Deadpool's Katanas, Backboard, Basement Key, Blue Light Lighter, Boggy Lamps looks so good. Anyways, uh, let me take this time to talk to you guys real quick. How y'all doing, chat? That doing good? How's y'all day been? And uh, let me know y'all favorite part of the Caribbean movie. I don't know how many there is, but I definitely got to rewatch them, to be honest. It's definitely giving me um, the itch to watch them again, chat. Next up, we got Quack Pack, Plasmatic. Number one, let me get a number two to go. Inky Eye, Shattered Wings, Solid Skull, Looks Solid, TA Hunted, Tana, TGZ Miyagi, Thunderbolt Ages, Zero, Wu-Tang, Wolfpack, and last but not least, Wix Katana. I seriously cannot get over Wix Katana. Probably one of the best backlinks in my opinion. It looks so solid on so many skins. Now for the Barbosa combos. First we got Robert's Perch, Borealis Backer, Sidio of the Alliance, Weapons of Witcher looks so good. Good girl. Fire Starter, Avatar Cycle, Perfect Wings, Wasteland Cloak looks so good. Anyways, a lot of these are going to be similar to uh, Davy Jones because it fits the similar vibe. And I want to just give you a, a chance to see how they look like on the skin as well. That Boggy Lamp looks so godlike on these pirate skins. Like the vibe, it's realistic. It looks good. I'm messing with it. The toes look nice too. We got Frozen Shroud. Always a W combo. Galactic, Ghost Portal, High Caliber, Rear Guard, Quackity Pack. He do be quacking though. Number one, let me get a three to go. We got Shattered Wings, Solid Skull, TA Hunted, Tana, we got Teachings of Miyagi, Thunderbolt Ages, Zero, Wu Tang Represent, Wolf Pack, and last but not least, Wix Katana. Anyways, is the bundle worth buying? Are the skins worth buying? In my humble opinion, I think they are. If you're a fan of Pirates of the Caribbean, I think this is a very solid choice. It says 5200. I don't know why it says that when you buy it. If you're trying to gift, it will be 3400 which is a very solid price. You get three skins, three pickaxes, and two backlings. I think uh, because Barbosa doesn't have a backling, maybe that's why they include the, the emote itself. Which is not a bad trade-off, but I do wish we had a backlink from him, to be honest. Let me know what backlink you guys would give him. I have not seen the, show, um, I have not seen the movie in a minute, so I'm, I can't really uh, remember like any unique items he might have had. Maybe even the sword is a back, uh, backling. That would have been nice. Keep in mind, even if you buy one skin separately, it will retroactively add the discount to the bundle in the future. So when it comes back, the bundle will be cheaper since you already bought one of the skins. Something to keep in mind. I love that Epic's doing that. I hope they never change that. And uh, yeah, let me know which one is your favorite. Which one are you going to cop? And don't forget the motto. Cop what you like. Don't fall for the hype. Because at the end of the day, if you buy something because everybody else is buying it, you're going to be got out when the good stuff comes you know what i mean you're not gonna have no more v-bonks for the juicy stuff that's gonna come in the future but i think they're worth it very solid skins i love the realism and i think it's time to watch parents of the caribbean anyways it's very healthy and you want to support the channel use code crow dash selection item shop catch your boy live on twitch 
I'll drop a gameplay on the skin, it'll be in the pinned comments below. It's your boy Crow, W. Davy Jones, W. Baby Girl, she look good. Holla at your boy, Gil.